Hello! Alright man, so Kerry King has been in the news a lot lately. He's all over CNN, MSNBC, uh, Fox Business, all the, oh, RT, I've seen him on there. Lots of stuff, man. And, uh, pumping up his new uh, solo record that no one really gives a fuck about. Uh, I saw this fucking... I'm sorry, man. Like, I know this is a stupid video. I had to fucking laugh, man. Blabbermouth.net. Where else? Who else would report this shit? This is my source for this video. I saw this uh, headline. Carrie King says, I lost 10 pounds not even trying. I, I don't know if you guys will think it's funny, man, but I thought that's a funny fucking... Like, a journalist got paid to write this, dude. I mean, God, I'm not even getting paid I'm talking about it, man. So I guess who's the who's the fucking idiot here? All right, let's see what Kerry has to say about his weight loss journey. All right, man. By the way, I would you guys remember that show, The Biggest Loser? Uh, I would love to have, uh, like, a heavy metal or, like, hard rock version of The Biggest Loser. You could... Where that show, that competition show where everyone's, like, competing to gain or uh, lose weight... Like, you could have uh, John Oliva from Sabotage, man. You could have fucking uh, Vince Neil. I think it'd be really funny, dude. Anyway, man, here's what Kerry has to say. He says, quote, The last couple of months, I just started eating less. I looked in the mirror one day, and I went, I think I lost some weight. And I lost like 10 pounds, not even trying. I think New York finally wore off on me. I didn't have to go eat everything every day. I just had more of a normal diet. And that was just a natural thing. There's a gym in my building. I'll go and do cardio. I walk everywhere in New York. I sold my cars. If we got to go somewhere far, we take the train. We take an Uber. Whatever. But we walk everywhere. That has a big reaction in your body. Walking is great. I just started playing guitar standing up again for the first time in like four years. I did that three weeks ago. So yeah, I can play standing up now. Just be aware, I'm not young. My guitars are extremely heavy. <laughs> Alright, great reason to write a fucking news article, man. I figured I had to report on that. Uh, comment below, man. Tell us about your weight loss journey, man. Are you trying to lose weight? Uh, did you used to be fat and now you're losing weight? You know, I actually... Uh, not that anyone gives a fuck about me, but last year, man, I actually... Uh, uh, I stopped eating fast food. It was actually sometime towards the end of 2022, like fast food got to a point where, uh, you know, it's like $15, $16 to go to fucking Wendy's, man. Fuck that, dude. I remember back in the day, dude, you go there with like two bucks in your pocket and you leave with a whole bag of shit, you know, you'd be full for like a day or two, you know, now it's totally different, dude. The whole fast food economy is fucked. And the food's not good enough to justify it. So I figure Kerry King probably used to eat a lot of like Wendy's, Taco Bell. And he might just not be able to afford it anymore, man. I mean, uh, who knows? Maybe he's actually uh, doing the Jane Fonda workout thing. I don't know, man. But I, I'm happy for him. You know, 10 pounds ain't easy when you're like 60 years old. Uh, I lost like, fuck, man. I went from like 210 to around 160, man. And then 160, dude, I was starting to look a little fucking emaciated. I was looking like one of those heroin punk rock, you know, heroin chic type people. And so I actually, I've actually been uh, drinking a little more to kind of bulk up a bit, you know, get back to I'm more comfortable, more comfortable around 170, you know. So let us know in the comments, man, what's your preferred weight? Uh, and, you know, hats off to Kerry King, man. Have a great night.